Hello, dearies! It is time at long last to finish the long-awaited uh, chapter of The Walking Dead Michonne. And indeed, it is called What We Deserve, and we shall see indeed what in fact we do deserve. Probably dead children. Just calling it out right now. But hey, let's see. Oh, I remember that part! And what followed next? Pete! Hello, Petey boy! I actually remember his time, uh, his name this time. Randall should be the one laying there, not your brother. Oh, God. I'm not leaving you behind. That was just Start too icky. And our chances of making it out of here, any of us, go down to zero. That much I guessed. And yet we did get out. They, they had some supplies just sitting out and Norma caught me. I didn't think she was going to, but she, she, she let me go. And the children. Michelle. It's always with the children, is isn't it? I'm looking forward to understanding just what happens with them. That was the most obvious dead ever. If you go back to my video, I totally called it out. Yes, that means the dance is over. You're a real charmer. Charmer. What's wrong with me today? Chairman. Your funeral. Jesus. Anyway, I decided not to kill him last time because I thought he would be far more valuable alive. Which hopefully you can understand. Oh god. I can feel a lot of trauma coming on after this episode. Ooh, a flashback. I know how Telltale loves its flashbacks. Simpler, better times, right? Hope you're not thinking about jumping. Because if you do, I'm gonna have to come in after you. I'm not looking forward to that. Water's gonna be an ice bowl. No one wants to see that, Oak. Yeah, I know. <laughs> the Englishman. Freezing my ass off. Yeah. Yeah. Imagine how I'm Coffee feeling. Coffee warm you up. Go on. I mean, look at my jacket. <laughs> Can I even call it that? God damn, Oak. You can't call it coffee when more than half's whiskey. <laughs> you sound like my ex-wife. Hmm. She Maybe she had a point. A you know, you might not have considered that, but <laughs> Can we stay in the flashback forever? When I first got on board. They grow on you. Like mole they are. Yeah. Nah, nah, sorry, that shit is now. They're growing on me too. Kinda nice that people can still joke around. It's a fine line between the court jester and the village idiot. Yeah. You can guess which side I think he's on. Think I can, yeah. Before I joined up with Pete, my brother and I were cooped up in an old canning factory. Food for ages. A lot of fat and happy people. But then, a young girl got taken. We followed her trail. It wasn't hard with all the blood. 
taken? Ended up cornering the people who took her. Oh gosh. In this warehouse. Of course. Ten of us went in. Only I came out. In the middle of a zombie apocalypse, the ones you really have to look. Ugh. Why do you bother? You did the right thing. And it got my brother killed. The right thing can kiss my ass. A few weeks later, I came across Pete, a ways up the coast. He saw that look on my face and he offered me a job. Didn't ask any questions, didn't turn me away, just welcomed me in. Well, Pete's he a good is. Egg in a world. Too nice for his own good, but. I'm still glad there are people, people like him, even like him in this best. world. I'll drink to that. The few people you don't have to constantly watch out well, for. I think Berto's little routine is winding down, so we can finally play cards. Care to join us? It'd be nice to have you there. Besides, sure. None of us can remember the rules, so it'll be the most. Uh, Unique game of go fish you've ever played. Yeah. <laughs> Do me in. Sounds like a challenge. You might regret it when I win that machete of yours. I still want to know where her bloody samurai sword is. And yes, I know it's called a katana. Fun on the shore. One seventh of the game has now been played. I mean, the episode. <coughs> Sure you want to be there. I need to see him. I need to see that bastard's face. Well, hey there, Michonne. Sam, I knew you couldn't stay away. Don't fucking talk to me. <laughs> Sam, stop! We Is need him right? alive. Jesus. A little help here! Please, I need a hand! Hey, let go of me! Thank you. Why did you stop me? Because we need him alive! You... Why are you protecting him? You, you know what he did. You should be better than that, Sam. Don't be like him. Or like you? Yeah. You're stating the obvious here. It's true. <laughs> there are better things to be than me, Derry. It's funny here. Is you think me and my sister are the bad ones. But you're the one who burned down our home. Forced our people on the shore to be easy pickings for the walkers. Families, kids, never did shit to you. Oh, you Stop didn't do think shit. About all the lives you were screwing up. All the shit they had to leave behind. But that was an accident. Tell that to the parents who lost their kids. He's only trying to piss you off. You're done talking. You're the one who should be dead. Sam, calm down. My dad isn't even in the fucking ground yet, and you want me to calm down? I, I didn't mean he ruined everything. He did kill her he father. Killed... I know, I know. Pick you don't know. Show. Wait. You hear that? Yes, it's... Um... Answer me. Now. That woman, her sister, his sister. Michonne, you don't want to keep me waiting. I'm right here. Good. You might be sitting pretty thinking you have the upper hand, but your luck has changed. Michonne and Sadiq, they got the rest of the crew too, Oak and Berto. Look, whatever this bitch asks, don't... Sadiq! Don't worry, they're all in good hands here. But them staying that way is up to you. So listen closely. I'm, I'm pretty sure that even my if brother for your friends. I give the brother, they'll still have to But anything you do to Randall, I will do to them. Do you understand? But I have to try, right? I mean, that's what a good person would do. Ah, <sighs> decisions, decisions. I'll see how badly you hurt him. Look, you don't owe me anything, but please, we have to get them back. I understand. That's what I like to hear. 
Norma, that was the name. We'll be there by sunrise. Be ready for us. Oh, what Shit. joy. And it froze again. Which happens often with this game for some reason. Huh. Oh well. Back to normal. <laughs> Stop laughing, you creep. What do we in fact deserve, any of us? Because I don't think anyone's entitled to anything. In fact, I would go as far as to say that we don't get what we deserve. We get what we get. Oh well. You don't look too great, pal. <laughs> what? There's something on my face. Uh, the bruises aren't so bad, right? I mean, maybe a scar or five. But hey, these things happen constantly. I'm pretty sure she'll notice the fingers. Shut up. Maybe it won't matter. This has to work. It could be worse, you know. At least he's not dead. He is not we'll yet dead. Alive. That's if Norma keeps her word. Well, if she doesn't, her the brother. The minute you hand him over, she's gonna take that bag off his head. What then? <laughs> <laughs> you all have no idea what you're in for. <sighs> he's right. True enough. Norma's not gonna leave us alone. She won't stop just because we gave her her brother back. Sure, you kept him alive, but we still burned all their shit. Yeah, I know. So we run. After you trade for your friends, we haul ass to the back gate and get the hell out of here. But she'd take the house. Let her have it. Wouldn't she expect us to run? So what? She knows where we are now. Hiding isn't an option. So let's just go. Stop. It's not gonna be that easy, Paige. If we run, they'll chase us. But maybe we get away. If we stay here, there's no chance we get out of this alive. She is okay, raising some this. valuable points. Sam, come back here. And the kids. We've got two kids with us. Which is not an easy thing to I'll do. It's not easy to look after in the zombie Sam! apocalypse. <clears throat> Sam, stop. You're going to hurt yourself. God damn it. Sam, stop. Maybe you're all ready to walk away, but I'm not just gonna leave him like this. <laughs> we couldn't give my mom a real funeral. My dad and I had to bury her here. Just the two of us. He'd want to be with her. <laughs> That's all I can give him. I understand. You should yeah. be buried with your mom. But we can't focus on that right now. We have to be ready to leave. I'm not going. What? Uh, Sam, you can't still be thinking. My mom is here, Paige. Everything I have of her. And Greg, if you want to leave, go ahead. But I'm not coming with you. I really hope I can make her reconsider leaving her here is Oh god I'm sorry but I I can't go This house meant everything to my dad It's all I have left I'm not just going to abandon it So what happens when Norma comes We fight 
with everything we have. Leaving you here is a death warrant. No matter what happens, thank you. I owe you my life. Sorry it took me so long to say it. <sighs> I wish you could say it under better circumstances. Gosh, I hope she'll have the time to remember it. I know it's stupid, but I have to finish this. I've got some weapons stashed in my room. Old <clears> duffel <throat> bag. Should look familiar. You should make sure everyone's armed before Norma gets here. Oh, just like the duffel bag that started all this nonsense. Yeah, I don't like duffel bags. Hello, James. Hey. I, I was just. I, I get it. Good. It felt like. Yeah. I, I wasn't gonna shoot it. Just. And? How does it feel? It's, it's heavy. Let's teach the kids some responsibility. If we can. Empty. I'm sorry, but under the circumstances, we can't really allow kids to be kids anymore. Can I help? One of the many cruelties of this world. I want to do something. Sure, go ahead. Those slide in there. Round side forward. How could they just die like that? And Dad, I, I thought we were safe here. You're. What am I supposed to do? Never safe. You have to be smart. That's how you survive. My dad was the smartest guy I knew. That didn't save him. Not smart enough to close the gate, though. <laughs> the guy who did it killed my dad. He's got a. I mean, the things he said, the way he was laughing about Dad, he can't get away with it. We have to give Randall back to his sister, James. I know it's tough, but if we don't... talking, there's more people coming to the house. Sam's hurt. If, if she... They can't hurt her, too. You have to stop them. Your sister will be with me. I'll make sure she's safe. I'll do my best. Gosh, yeah. I hope I can save her. I, I don't know if I'm ready. You know, to have one. Take this to your sister. Norma's on her way. Things could go wrong in a hurry. I don't want to give him a gun yet. I know I just said that kids can't be kids, but... She didn't always come to this. Yeah. I'd rather Sam had a gun. Ugh. Janie, Rich, what's hold up? Prisoners aren't cooperating. What do you want to do? Yeah, we don't have time for this. Get him moving. Oh gosh. Oh, time to look Hell, around. Let's on this one. I hope he's okay. Let's see, anyone here? Passport. Sam's passport. Oh, she this has one. Be her mother, Sophia Fairbanks. Almost out of space in these. Right behind you. Wow, well, they went all over the world together. Those days are long gone now. 
No world to go to. Not anymore. World's gone to shit, buddy. Hey, thanks for before. Sure. I, uh, I couldn't have moved it myself. Something you need? Want a hand? No. Having something to do helps me not think about everything. Paige thinks we're not safe here. Now we need to move on. But she's trying to convince you to leave too. She's wanted out of here for a while. She's well, I'm not chance. leaving without you, so I'm not leaving without you. But I hope to leave I with you. I blame you if you did. You're here to get your people back, and that's fine. None of this is your mess. It's just so much of this place is my dad. It's all of us. He worked his way up from nothing. I wish we had more people. Houses, paid his way through law school. When he bought this house, it was it was proof that he'd made a better life for us. We grew up here. I. Maybe I'm crazy, but I can't let that all be for nothing. He was so proud of what he built. This place kept us safe. We were happy here. Norma doesn't care about any of that. She's coming here, and she's not going to stop just because this place has sentimental value. I know. That's the reality of it, kid. I understand. Oh, but I do. I just don't want to see you dead here. Work. I really, really don't. Let's see if Pete is in the kitchen. No. Hey, Paige is in the garage. Explosive. For anything. Almost anything. Very many explosive thingsies. Excellent! Don't suppose we can prepare a few traps? Nearly empty. Well, that answer's not, I suppose. This must be how they reinforce the gate. Hope it keeps Norma out. Judging from the game's tra trailer, I don't think so. But hey, hoping is always good. And by the way, that trailer, the trailer to... If we get pinned down, we won't last more than a few days on this stuff. What we deserve, totally spoiler filled. Annoying that way. Right. No more see right through this. I want to punch you, but I won't because I'm so nice. You know, my hands hurt a little bit. You got any ointment lying around? Yeah, sure. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, and well, you were playing the good guy card. She'll bust down that little gate of yours and tune you up good. March on in. Majestic as fuck. Yeah, you said. Don't make it any less true. <laughs> Here, have a bag. Now you Don't look a much more likable than you did just a minute ago. Which isn't difficult, really, with her nose as practically. This is a mess. I can't believe how fucking stupid I was. Get so focused on finding people. I wasn't putting the crew first. I didn't insist on looking. If I didn't turn us around and lead us here, none of this would have happened. It's not Don't your fault. Worry. You didn't know this would happen. Oak knew. I should have fucking listened. Oh didn't well. After all this time, after everything we've had to do to survive, people would want to help each other. They're just guarding what's theirs and taking out whoever gets in their way. 
I don't know why I even bother trying to help anymore. People don't Doesn't seem worth it. really care Maybe I was much about one another. I wanted to think there were people worth helping. And now we all have to pay the price for it. This isn't you, Pete. Be true to you yourself, help Pete. You help me. Don't give up. I won't. We just... We have to get my crew back. Hopefully my boat is still in one piece. Shit. I kind of doubt it. If Norma's coming for a fight, are we really prepared for that? These well, kids, they aren't up for this. Norma's not gonna stop. She may say she wants to make a deal, but I don't believe that for a second. We're gonna have to do I. fight. Here, have a gun, Pete. I trust you. Or maybe we'll keep chatting away. Yeah, have a gun, Pete. Here, Pete. Thanks. Right. Oh, an iron poker. Can we use that to stab people? Not gonna be able to look at that the same way again. Yeah. We did kind of use it to cauterize Sam's wound, didn't we? That was a nasty piece of business. Just make sure everyone else is ready when Norma comes. Yeah. I'm trying, mate. Mate. Sorry. You annoying nutcracker. I still don't like him. Anyway, why is Sam's room downstairs? I mean, who would even build a living room for a kid downstairs and not upstairs? Nonsensical. Absolutely. Oh no. His Memories. Name? Music? Oh gosh. Demented dreams, demented dreams. Here, over here. I like that. It's pretty. My dad gave it to me, so I wouldn't have to hear the things out there. As long as I stay in my fortress, I'm safe. It keeps all the bad stuff out. I put pillows and blankets against the wall. Was this your dad's idea? Yeah. My dad makes sure I'm always safe, so nothing can happen to me. No. Mm. Ever. Especially not those... things. I know what those monsters out there are. One to go. Grandma told me about them. It's what happens when someone... eats another person. Oh? I hadn't heard that one before. Oh, Wendigos. Do they scare you too? They make lots of noise. Even at night. I'll tell you a secret. They scare me too sometimes. Really? Yeah. But really. my dad's not scared of them. I've been waiting for him. Where is he? Why didn't he come get me yet? Where is my dad? I'm sorry. Your dad's not coming. He's dead. What? He got shot outside. No! I don't believe you! I want to see him. Please. <laughs> Did my dad be become one of them? 
No. It, it, it's what happens, right? He did, didn't he? No, your dad didn't become one of them. <laughs> Still your dad. It's not fair. Alex, you need to be strong, okay? I can't. You have to be. Hey, keep the chatter to a minimum. Our friends are listening. <laughs> Norma. James Fairbanks. Alex Fairbanks. Oh gosh. This is getting creepier. I remember getting my law degree. Doesn't mean much now. Gosh, this is so creepy. Hello, Paige. Oh, hey, I, I didn't hear you come in. Were you able to talk some sense into her? Or do you still think digging a hole is a good use of Sam's time? I've never seen her like this. She's, I can't. She's not thinking. I'm not gonna stop her from burying her father. You act like I'm doing this to be cruel. I get why she wants to do it, but we just can't. Not with Norma on her way. I don't know why Sam thinks she can protect her brothers here. I'll be out of your hair soon enough. Never you don't have to anyway. go. Same as you. That's one thing we got in common. Squatters in other people's lives. This is your home. This place was never mine. They let me hang around, play make-believe. I left my real life a long time ago. We all did. Norma's gonna be here soon. If they're not ready... I won't stick around just to watch this fall apart. She's so stubborn, though. I just hope it doesn't get her killed this time. Then stay. Sam needs you. You're gonna regret it if you leave. Trust me. The Fairbanks kept me safe, but... I don't know if I can do the same for them. You could at least try. Here. Let's see what Rocky Horrors are going to... Go on around the room now! No? No flashy showing of dead kids? I'm always almost disappointed. Almost. Mostly relieved, honestly. Oh, Michonne. I'm uh, looking for Alex. Have you seen him? I want him to be there when I say a few words for Dad. He wasn't at Mom's funeral. He should be there for this. I told him about John. Alex asked about his father. So... I told him what happened. Oh, shit. I, uh, I should check on him then. You'll find him in his fortress. I'll meet you outside. Sure. Telling him was the right decision, right? I mean, of course it was right. I 
I just don't see a nice way of this ending. It's very symbolic though. Two young kids that she's desperately trying to protect now. Sam? Their mum died. You okay? Their dad died later. Greg and Dad? I just... I don't really know what to say. Where am I supposed to start? Just say what he meant to you. Yeah. Okay. I'll give you a moment. Hey, you okay? No, not really. How can anyone be okay after that? Michonne. Just thinking about my kids. I keep seeing them. Hang in there. We'll be back out on the water soon. I'm not sure that we will. You know I envy them a little. They've How managed so? to hold on to something we all lost a long time ago. Something like you. Or they just lost it. I don't know how to describe it. Feels like before. Just a little bit. I'm like an idiot, don't I? Your boat comes close to that. You kind of forget everything else while you're out there. It was nice while it lasted. Hey, I decided to stay. Thank you. For Sam. Don't get cocky. It had nothing to do with what you said. Uh huh. <laughs> She's here! 